the Undercity has been fought and claimed in the final Hearthstone Masters Tour event of the 2021 season. 376 players came down to just one as China's Xiao Ti took his place among Masters Tour champions after a 3-0 victory against Hong Kong card slinger Dragon Man. Xiao Ti's first victory in the grand final was his OTK Demon Hunter, a deck that focuses on draw before slamming the opponent's face for a godly amount of damage. The deck's strategy was best performed in the semi-finals against fellow Chinese player Tian Ming after Xiao Ti completed his Close the Portal quest on turn 5. Once played, every card drawn from his deck had their cost reduced by two, making it cheaper and easier to set up the one-turn kill. The OTK deck is built around Ilganoth. All lifesteal damage struck his opponent directly rather than healed himself moving forward. A Moag Artificer was there to double the damage of spells to all minions. A guild trader and talented arcanist increased spell damage dramatically, but at the end of the day, it was a fell scream blast that obliterated his own minions for 30 lifesteal damage, which in turn defeated Tian Ming with one heavily destructive spell. Next up was Xiao Ti's Quest Warlock, a deck that finds value in draining itself and inflicting damage to Xiao Ti. Or else I think he's in big trouble. An early Antheron was played when Xiao Ti's hand was full. This placed a brutal 8-6 demon on the board to create pressure. Goldshine Knoll works in a similar way. With a full hand, this 5-4 rush unit acts as a cheap way of clearing a minion on Dragon Man's side of the board. Knowing that his opponent's deck was chock full of spells, a cult neophyte's battle cry will increase their cost by one on the following turn, destroying any chance for Dragon Man to set up a druid spellcasting combo. With cards like Raise Dead to inflict damage, it wasn't long before Flesh Giants were summoned into battle. With no removal, these 8-8 cheap-costing minions were free to attack Dragon Man's face. To finish off Dragon Man in three straight games, Xiao Ti's cheap and effective Pirate Quest deck came alive in the Undercity Grand Final. This deck was performed spectacularly in the semi-finals against Tian Ming. An early use of a Blood Sail deck hand made Xiao Ti's next weapon cost one less. With a free Whetstone Hatchet, Xiao Ti was able to give a minion in his hand plus one attack, setting him up for the turns ahead. With the weapon to swing at his opponent, Defias Cannoneer could deal damage to a random enemy minion twice, helping Xiao Ti clear his opponent's board. With weapons in the deck and a quest that relies heavily on pirates, the Ratchet Privateer was a no-brainer for Xiao Ti, offering both extra weapon damage and 4-3 in stats the moment it's played. These three decks helped Xiao Ti climb the Undercity ranks and will help you achieve victory in your next game of Hearthstone. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button to keep up to date with the amazing esport content from around the gaming globe. Only on Unbeaten Esports.